starts now like do we see this like y'all can't see a tripod clearly but it's way smaller than that that big stick that i had if you know you know like why do i just feel a glow with this new tripod because i got homecoming this week next week and i wasn't finna bring this big tripod into the concert like they, they was finna like take my tripod because it looks like a weapon it could low-key be used as a weapon the homecoming vlog starts now bookie this may look like so small literally in my hand i put it in my pocket i'm literally so happy and now i feel more comfortable vlogging in a grocery store but the homecoming vlog starts now but i'm gonna do my intro when i get in my room because i'm looking nervous in front of these people literally in love like oh mg i can just move around so much better uh. hello my lovelies if you're new here my name is olivia lorraine i am a full-time content creator and hbcu college student at the tennessee state university if you're not new here you already know what time it is, Bookie. You already know what time it is. And today, yeah, we are starting the official, the annual, the big, the grand homecoming vlog. What are you talking about? We're gonna start this vlog off. I'm about to get my hair done because I know y'all see them crispy, nasty edges. We're not gonna talk about it. My girl Court is doing my hair. I'm gonna put her channel here because you know, girls support girls, and that's my girl. Her. Under this scarf, I'm gonna tell y'all, I've been wearing this scarf to the grave, to the ground, to the six feet under like bookie my hair's not done we're about to wash my hair because she's going to do my hair at around 5 30 and i'm over here lagging stalling let me just give you a little life update um i've been going through it <laughs> let's be real but i haven't been as active because school be kicking my butt but i'd rather be less active and focusing on academics and giving y'all updates on like when i release videos rather than just going ghost and not telling y'all anything you feel today is the fourth our anniversary yesterday was national boyfriend day and again, if you know, you know, I look, he did my little big one for my man. I cooked for him, his favorite food, and we blew out a cake for our anniversary because today we were both busy. Um, hair is today, nails is Saturday. I'm glad that I didn't do nails and then hair because I will be like washing my hair and my nails, you feel me? And I don't want a chance of like a charm falling off or whatever. I'm just getting shorties. I just feel like shorty nails are just more a classier, clean girl look and i only do long nails on occasion medium nails i could okay i could do medium or short nails but long nails i don't really like long nails unless like a birthday or a special event like i said let me show y'all the tripod <laughs> i know you heard that okay this is the tripod this is the other one like there was no way they was finna let me walk in the concert with this night stick like football game with this they was not feeling let me walk in a concert with this because if i fold it down and i carry it like this it looks like a night stick like this could literally be used as a weapon so i was like no i need to get a new tripod like no like this is not gonna work for me i'm gonna show y'all my new tripod i'm just saying like, my new baby okay so don't mind my dirty mirror but this is the new baby like do y'all see like y'all can just see on my face like the glow i feel so much better but yes, like I said, this is the annual homecoming vlog, you feel me? Now I gotta pick an outfit, cause if you know, you gotta have that outfit for when you get your hair done. You gotta look cute, you feel me? I'm gonna just do these sweatpants, the Yeezy slides, no socks, not too much. I painted my toes. I'm gonna bring my bag, cause I'm probably gonna do some work on my, I'm gonna edit. Cause I do have a whole video to put out when I went to the African Street Festival. Hopefully by the time, well, yeah, this video is going to be up by the time. Or that video is going to be up by the time, so. But yeah, I'm probably going to hit y'all when I get my hair done, so. Bye! Alright, y'all, so my hair is done. I definitely didn't film. 
but that don't matter. But anyway, this is my hair. I'm gonna post my girl's, my girl Court's page because she is rebranded right now. So yeah. And now I'm gonna go see my man to show him. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I got hungry, so I had got me some food. But I'm gonna show him my hair. He's about to walk out because he had went to his friend's room right quick. So he's gonna come out of his friend's room. And normally when I get my hair done, he be going crazy. So normally every time I get my hair done, we be ranking the styles. I be like, okay, rate this style, rate this lock style, rate this lock style. We are gonna see what he rates this one. This is really my top two. Like, I don't know. I don't know. You get your hair done. You just feel like, I just feel clean. Like I'm already clean. Don't get me wrong. Don't. Don't do, don't do me. Like the glow, the face glow that you get, the clear skin you get when your hair done, that's what I got right now. Hmm? <laughs> I hope you know the cameras are rolling. I said I'm gonna get your reaction to my hair. <laughs> Dude, your stuff good. You like it? Is it tight? Yeah. Touch it. I'm gonna touch it, I don't wanna touch it. Uh, to the people that we be rating our lock styles, so. What would you rate this one? Touching mm. my edges, they fresh. Top five. Four? Y'all seen he was about to give it a four? You got them, you did Bantu, four? you did Bantu knots. Oh yeah, Bantu knot is You got favorite. Bantu knots, and you got your regular, just original retwist and lashes. That's forever gonna be number one. Wait, original retwist? Like, retwist, no style. I'm gonna put a lashes. picture of what he's talking about, I know what he's talking about. Oh. Retwist lashes is four. No, retwist lashes number one. So what is this, this is one? Four. This is four? Hit me out. Yeah. Okay, maybe I'm gonna throw on some lashes tomorrow. Yeah, and maybe it won't nice. be four once I throw the lashes on. You, got, you had your back to school hairstyle. I like the back to school nice. hairstyle four. In this three. I don't know. Okay, y'all. So y'all see my hair is done. We all seen that. Y'all knew that. But y'all finna see me like this a lot. Love it, my girl Court ate as she should per use. And now my fit's gonna be cute. Like I literally saved my like not even homecoming outfits, I'm like regular everyday outfits. Literally until I got my hair done. Cause I feel like my fits don't be popping unless your hair is done. You feel me? Why? But anyway, I'm finna heat up some of my lasagna soup that I made yesterday for National Boyfriend Day. And then do this work. Here's the nightstick that I was talking about. I showed y'all that already, but nice deep i love my baby though don't get me wrong but um i'm not gonna pick y'all back up until i get my nails done um sorry i didn't pick y'all up for my hair appointment we was just too busy talking catching up that's that was saturday saturday is i get my nails done and then it's homecoming countdown the official like homecoming festivities because da, 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 da. if you know me well you know i'm not a party person and i get like anxiety in the crowded areas prayers go out to morgan state university because now as i'm filming this yesterday we had a shooting after their coronation and now all their homecoming events are canceled so it's like you know it, it, it's a little shifty out here it's a little dangerous out here you know i'll go to like a set or a house party not like i don't i don't really know if i go to a party i'll go to a party if i don't no, i just don't but i'm gonna do this work i will hit you guys saturday yeah bye hey guys it is friday it is the 6th and somebody getting their hair done i'm not gonna show him because he don't want to be seen because he ain't got no haircuts he just said tomorrow anyways i hit 1k on tiktok <laughs> anyway he don't want me to scream so i'm not gonna scream but i love y'all dearly look at my little video my, i look bad oh, hold on i look i hit 1k gotta celebrate how am i how am i gonna celebrate and it's literally homecoming in like 24 hours i'm gonna head back what where am i gonna head back in with them 8 p.m tomorrow because that's homecoming countdown right hey guys it's saturday slight change of plans didn't get my nails done this morning because something had happened so she was like i could come tomorrow sunday at 11 30 but my man got a haircut y'all my man got a haircut mm. my man got a haircut butterfly don't move please don't move i will cry don't move she knew. It was right there. You see it? Oh, it. Okay, anyways, I'm putting this part in the homecoming part one because if you don't know, last year I did a part one and two 
because if I did it all together, it would have been like a three hour vlog and I don't know if y'all really gonna sit for a three hour video. Maybe a one hour, but three, no. This is gonna be a part of part one. Yeah. And we're going to homecoming shopping. Or he is, he's getting some shoes. I don't know if I'm gonna get some shoes today. I want Sambas. That's the shoes I'm ready for. I want the new school, like them just playing back on our new schools. I'm debating yeah. if, if I see something else I like, I might cop it, I don't know. Yeah. I'm gonna size of it. my shoes gonna be so one time. I'm not going up on 10. We're just trying to figure out which mall to go to. We're waiting for the Ubers to go down for whichever mall we go to. But um, y'all finna come shopping with us though, homecoming shopping. We finna eat first though, I ain't gonna lie because I'm hungry. And I'll tell y'all, not tell y'all, I'll pick y'all back up when we get there. Hey guys. Anyways, <coughs> we got our cheese steaks. I just got a regular one with no tomatoes and no green peppers. This one might look like, you got, you gotta say what you got. I got a chicken California with fries and a strawberry lemonade. Oh yeah, we both have strawberry. One thing about it, both of them, we gonna eat. I eat all day. Now I'm feeling nauseous before the Uber got here, so I needed a, fro a small fry, so we had a bunch of Chick-fil-A. And, oh yeah, he didn't get pickles on his either. He don't like pickles, but I do. I don't like pickles at all. And I know he gonna make me chew some gum if I wanna kiss him. Oh yeah. Unless you gonna buy the gum. We ran to our friend, we ran to Cam. He said, he said this was a better choice anyway. Because him and his friends had went to Opry and they were like, it wasn't that great. Good thing we didn't waste Uber money. Just to probably not find anything. And there's an Ulta here. So I get to go to Ulta and get my lip gloss if they have it. We gonna hit y'all. Where are we going? We probably gonna go to Ulta first because it's outside, like across the street. And then we gonna come back inside. But I'm gonna hit y'all when we get to Ulta. We just watched an American Girl. I wanted to show him my dog because I have an American Girl dog. Anyways, I have an American Girl dog, so I was showing him mine, but I couldn't find the exact so one. Outside, man. But right now we're going to Alta because I need my lip gloss. Like I need it. Like you don't need it. You want to. It's it's a, it's a need. Back with Kivo Cam. Anyways, she and her shopping at Ulta. Guys, I got it. She got her lip gloss. I can't show you too much, but I feel like y'all gonna she find got... out anyway. Don't worry, I'm gonna edit the video. I'm gonna put it right here. You're not editing. I don't know how to edit none. I'm not gonna lie. You, Emma. I think this is all I need, guys. All she needs, really. I'm gonna go buy some shoes in a little bit. I might buy me some other stuff. But which one? Which one? Hold on, this. The people are right there, not up in the air. Well, guess what? The followers are above us. Anyways. You say talk to the people on the camp. Hold on, wait. She got me messed up. Okay, guys. I got my stuff. And I used my coupon. So I only uh, had $3. only had to pay $9 instead of $13. Showing him the brand that I'm an ambassador for. I can't tell you right now until I actually get the uh, stuff. Like, until it actually comes here. I'm to make a video on it. Like a TikTok about it. But once I do, I will tell y'all about it. But this is it right here. Cute, cute, cute. Anyways, can you focus? <laughs> and it's a cleanser. Okay. I'm gonna stop gatekeeping because I know I hate when people gatekeep, so I'm not gonna gatekeep. This is the lip gloss. I'm gonna show you when I get outside, but this is my holy grail. I'm telling you, I literally love it. Hold on, let me, let me, let me, let me talk outside. Hey guys, this is the lip gloss. I don't like gatekeeping because I know I hate people gatekeep. It's NYX Butter Gloss, like six. Butter dollars. Gloss! All right. I know y'all probably be like, can he shut up? But no, he's never gonna shut up. He's never gonna shut up. Right, honest. If y'all start spamming hate comments, I'm gonna just talk more. I'm just gonna block y'all. We about to go to H&M because why? I'm going to style my man. Wait, no, this one, let's go. You want me to style him, I don't know why he's playing. Especially at h and I'm gonna put them on y'all. <laughs> like, literally, the good weather is making me have a good mood. Like, literally fall, and y'all see my fit on the first day, like, first fall fit, fly. Like, what is we talking about? The day has come. <laughs> Stop living me in, purr. I put him in, show the shirt. I've always wanted him to put, I've always wanted to put him in forest green and that day has arrived. 
Okay, you need to put up that dark gray. You already got black tees. Heck of black tees, I tell you. So right now, ooh, y'all, he would look good in this brown. He would look good in this brown. Good lord. Yeah. And then these little crew necks right here. Yeah, you're finna get one. Put up that brown. The day has come. Oh. Mm. This is the brown leaf. Let's see, that's a fit right there. You look good. Right he about to try on the two tops. You look good. Yeah. All right, guys. So I got this cute sweater. A little fall shopping, I guess. Cause I'm not wearing this for home. Cause I already like partially got my fits together. But we're getting this sweatshirt to match, and I'm just getting this cute sweater. After this, I don't really know where we're going. We're not going to go to bed because we're gonna come back to like Opry or something. Anyways. I don't know where we're going after this, I'm not gonna lie. But um low-key style bay. I made him get some stuff. But um, we're gonna get a line now. And I don't know what store we about to go in, but I'll definitely pick y'all back up. Whatever store. What you think? I mean they fit. I'm gonna order the ones the uh I'm ordered the 11. I'm sorry. Show the people the shoe. Show them the wrong shoe. Show them. I know, but I'm gonna put a picture. See, of I know these shoes, right? Um, I'm getting the black and white version. I had to try the 11 on. I'm gonna order it to win my friends' crib so they can go pick it up. So I'm gonna get them too, but the funds ain't funny right now. Greatest shoe in the world. Hey guys. So time later, I got overstimulated, so I didn't pick up the camera yeah um i'm gonna show you what i got when i get in the room and that's even if i have time because i'm probably not gonna get to count down to like what a smooth 9 30 10 this one be cold tonight so i'm not trying to stay next stand out in the cold that long but i know that amphitheater gonna be crowded for real you know yeah um, but he got shoes I don't know if you want to show them what you what you got. Got stuff for H and M too. Yeah, got stuff for H and M. I got a cute sweater. Y'all seen that? Y'all see what I got? Then I got my lipstick at Ulta, and then I got something else. New goes. schools. New schools. Look at that three D like shoe. She's gonna put a picture probably about right here. Yeah. All right, now we're gonna wait for the Uber, and I'm gonna get a milkshake, and then we're gonna go. Um, that's pretty much it. And I'm gonna show you what I got when I get back. If I have time, probably want to chill in the room. Took like a smooth nine, so we got time. But yeah, say bye. Bye. Peace. I'm Moshe. Here's mine. And we got matching sweatshirts. And I'm gonna style him. I'm really excited to style him. But I need a battery pack, y'all, because the way this week is gonna be so film packed, jam packed, fun packed. I need a battery pack. Okay. I got cookies and cream, by the way. I didn't tell you that. I got you cookies, cookies and cream. cream option? Yes. Uh, you want to try mine? I could have sworn you knew. No, I, mean, I never. <laughs> this is my first ever had a Chipotle milkshake. Honestly. Honestly, got true. You got it. That strawberry one smacking them. We both say the same for each other. This I. I don't know. All right, y'all, I'm back. Y'all hear me sniffling? Y'all see my nose red? Let me, first of all, turn this AC down. Because why is it 80 degrees in my room? Ain't nothing smooth but that criminal. Anyways. Yeah, I'm back. I actually, like, literally right as we got the Uber, I went straight in the my friend Emery car because she wanted to hang out. And she had, we had just went to Publix, and she wanted to go pick up some food. So that was literally it. That's why I'm getting back, like, later than I thought, I guess. I'm going to show you everything I got. Not everything, because, yeah. But, um, and then I got to charge my phone because ain't nothing funny about this 4%. And we're supposed to get geek, and I'm supposed to be vlogging for y'all. So, with that being said, I got a little headache, too. So I'm definitely going to eat something. And probably take a little uh, Motrin, because ain't nothing funny about that headache. I don't know if this is going to be enough, because, mind you, I'm going to be in a crowd. A no Amazon pretty little thing Timu Target or H and M. 
sweatpants H&M because I just seen them today but I didn't know if it was like you know I get my sweatpants from Target sometimes so yeah um H&M and then shoes new bounces I got from DTLR wait real but I'm gonna show y'all everything first thing that I got is Charlie Rouge and I feel like it's red that you're gonna find a Charlie Rouge so if you do then you just do but I got this white vest, y'all, for ten dollars with the hood. Like, who would be doing it like me? Like, you're is it eating? Now, mind you, mind you, I already got a hood on, so I probably wear this for like a crew neck, probably. I mean, the double is cute. I ain't gonna lie. You're not copying me, like, on this. And they had other colors too, so if they still got it, and if I still got the funds boogie then I'll go back and get the olive green because this is literally the devour. Yeah. Yeah. It's the dollars. Like, you're not talking to me. Then I got from Ulta. Let me see if I can show y'all better. Or, like, my points or whatever. But, I don't, y'all can't really see it because the word is, like, blended in. But, NYX Butter Gloss. If I go in a store and it's out of stock, I'm blaming y'all. Like, per period. And I got this from the men's section. Because men's section have better basics and crew necks and stuff than the women's section. So me and my man are matching. I got this for him to style with and then I like the color myself because brown is one of my favorite colors. Yeah, and we gonna match. Yeah. Then, I do not think this is something that I would get. I don't know why, but you know, I'm into fashion. So like, I'm starting to like expand my, my perspective on fashion and not really sticking to the same stuff, you know? I have this cute sweater, like, y'all can't really see, but this is real cute. Like, I'm gonna try it on. Um, I need to put my body on if I'm gonna try it on though, cause I ain't trying to mess up my hair. This is the sweater. It is so cute. H and M, like what? What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, y'all. So I'm on the way now. I need to just charge my phone. I'm going from five to eighty-eight. Eighty-eight. Eight, five hundred. I have no more decent percentage, and we're not gonna be out. No, we're gonna be out to like. 12. Might not get back to the rooms like 12, 15, 12, 20. So I hope this 80 lasts me. I'm not gonna lie. Let me just get this homecoming story. Y'all see, I was too pressed to put this vest on. And it looked real cute. The vest, Charlotte Roots. Y'all know the rest of the outfit. And told, because mommy was like, mommy told me that I should have a smaller bag because being in a crowd, you know, nobody like, you're not paying attention to this thing in your purse. And my purse is very easy. The black one I had today. Very easy to sneak into, so. Hey guys, oh it's cold. This is why I didn't want to leave early, but somebody did. Anyway, we here, not we not here. We meet up with our friends at Hell, and we speed walking. I hear music and stuff. Cool, crowd, amazing. I can't feel my face. I just can't feel my face. <laughs> There's no other part of the song. I just can't feel We my seen face. a little thick, little skunk button. He was thick. Like thick, <laughs> but Gosh. Betty in a cove purred, purred. My leg. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we have Pardon me, I've been still acting pro. Pardon me, I've been acting a little pro. Pardon me, I've been still acting pro. Pardon me, I've been still acting pro. Pardon me, Mr. Egg in the stove. Pardon me, I've been still acting pro. Pardon me, Mr. Banana in the stove. Pardon me, I've been still acting pro. Pardon me, Mr. Banana in the stove. Carbon sin on the seat in the floor. Carbon sin on the seat in the floor. Parking, I put that knife on your throat. Parch, I'ma step out of that hole. Walk a designer here down to the toe. Let me skip the back door. Get on that throat, she'll go. Smashing that throat, she'll go. Feeling like an igloo now. Going ready to hit you now. Bring the bit F out the house. Let the fuck niggas know who really get found. 400,000 right now. 400,000 on me right now. Pull up on the city, trying to hit it right now. I rock the Bentley in snow. Pull up at the house, she way outside. Little bitch is ready to go. Gotta see Sarge, brown like boot. It's still my brother, that nigga. Got my nails done. I didn't show y'all the clip because I don't know why I didn't vlog. It was it was too early for me. I literally rolled up out the bed, brushed my teeth, and went to my appointment. I'll show y'all a better picture, or maybe I'll show y'all later. But we on the way to the cab. Oh, I'm gonna go 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 to the cab. Oh, I'm g
go jump off a bridge. Yeah. You don't tell them what you just did? Halloween. Oh, Halloween. Mm -hmm. See the nails? She said I gotta put barbecue sauce on it. There is no I gotta put barbecue sauce on it. This man. I'm gonna bring barbecue sauce to yeah. the cat. I couldn't be unprepared. It's yeah. big, she said the full pork. Right, it's not even like a little handheld. It's the region. I don't want to call that so greedy. She was joking. And then he go in the backpack. Stop playing. Uh-oh. 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 Uh-o
Hello, my lovelies. It is Monday. Yes, Monday. Video was up, y'all. Go, mm, go watch my video. Go watch it. Right now, I'm about to get ready because I got to do a whole. Uh, 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 uh. Well, I'm vlogging for y'all. One. Then I'm doing TikTok. Like, get ready with me. Homecoming day one. Why? Yeah. My man's already dressed. Like, his fit. Hey, like, what is she talking about? Thought about who? Mwah. Anyway, I need to make my bed atrocious. I just got out of it. Um, so I'm gonna do that and then I'm gonna get ready. And you have to come with me. Routine. Now I'm gonna do makeup and I don't know what I'm gonna do on my face. Like I put, I took off the bonnet because I don't want it messing up my lining. Cause sometimes like it'll stop here, like the makeup will stop here, and now I have to like powder like the rest, you know. Plus I'm doing my edges. Cause I literally waited until I'm coming week to do my edges. Cause do y'all see like they grew out real fast. I'm about to. I'm not even finna um put no background music over this. I'm actually gonna talk to y'all this time because I always like put background music over and i know y'all just don't want to sit there and see me do a makeup routine so i was like why not talk to y'all so yeah a little life update i'm not trying to tell too much but life update i'm trying to keep my life more private even though i am a content creator you can still keep your life private as a creator but you know relationship wise i just feel like i know what's mine i know what's secure i know my spot is secure feels more secure than in my past so i feel like that's why i'm so comfortable like showing y'all what i want to show y'all and i don't even show y'all everything in my relationship like i don't but of course i'm not gonna show y'all the deep down stuff of course but you know like showcasing your relationship on social media social media has made it out to seem like you can't show your man or show your show off your woman Oh, it's like, oh, that's too much. Like, da da da. You're showing her off too much. Da da da. So, like, as long as you know your spot is secure, there should be no problem. Now, see, me, I'm a little Delulu. I feel like in my past, I was Delulu because I was posting that person a lot, not even knowing the mess that was going on behind closed doors. But that was my fault. That was my Delulu fault. So, getting into this new relationship like god allowing god centered it just like i just felt more comfortable posting him because i knew that he was secure i know my spot is secure i know we are secure no threats are breaking up like it's just totally new like it's something we're both still getting used to like we're both still getting used to like i don't know like the healthy like healthiness of a relationship you know because we both didn't really have that we both got quite a past okay okay so i just feel like i should be allowed to showcase my man on my platform when i do so please and there will be times where i'm like okay i'm not gonna show him as much like i don't post him man i don't post him every day you know but he is in my youtube videos you know so it's not like a thing like i can keep him private i mean i can i mean there's really no point of keeping him private like we can keep our relationship private but not private but not secret that's basically where i'm going with this whole shenanigan i showcase like i post content on our dates because you know i love like giving y'all ideas like date ideas stuff like that and also another thing like coming from let me not say that <laughs> but um yeah coming into this relationship i'm not even gonna lie it you know it's good when it feels like a too good to be true type of thing you feel so i was like oh texting my best friends i'm like y'all like he bought me flowers da -da -da -da. like this is all new to me like i was getting scared i was overthinking this is the uh what's the name that i use the um for the focus it's like a real creator doing this right now I'll just put it like a picture of it, but this is the what's name that I use. It's a mist. It's not like a yeah. Like people ask me how my relationship's going. It's going good. That's all you need to know. 
because I don't like giving details in my relationship because it's none of y'all's business. Like, and I stopped. I've learned. That's one thing I've learned from my past. Don't run to your friends or your family about your relationship. Y'all, please do not. Like, don't run to your family or friends about your relationship. But it's going to backfire. Like, you tell them, like, oh, well, let's say you tell them that y'all got in an argument. And then your family's going to have in their head, oh, they're not treating my so-and-so right. They're not treating my daughter right. They're not treating my granddaughter right. da 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 then you go back to them and you're like, oh, we just hit our one year, da 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 And they're gonna be like, but didn't he just do you dirty? Or when he comes around, it's a weird vibe. And that's because you told them information, you feel? I just feel like family, friends should not have an input on your relationship, which is why I stopped going. It's nothing against my best friends, but they'll un they're un they'll understand. Like, they will understand when they get in love. One of my best friends is in love. Like, when they get in love, and she even, one of my best friends is in love and she don't even tell me her business. Like, when we catch up, let me stop lying. That's probably my best friend, though. But, like, we don't tell each other for advice. We tell each other to, like, catch up and talk. I used to go, like, run to my friends after every argument and getting opinions on relationships from other ears, other eyes. And, yeah, that's, yeah. Little relationship advice seven minute video clip from Liv. Um, what else advice can I give y'all? I don't really know. I really don't. Relationship advice. How did this turn into relationship advice? This is supposed to be a life update. Um, communicate. I don't think I need to say much else. Communicate. Like if I get upset, I just shut down. And I tell you later on what the problem was. Like you get, like you get it. Like if you ask me what's wrong right there in that moment, I'm not gonna tell you. But you gotta give me time. Like I'll tell you an hour later, some time later. Like I'm going to eventually tell you. It's just not gonna be right now. You know. Be honest with your partner. It's really not that hard. People make it social media. Let's talk about it because social media. Like I'll be scrolling past the negative TikToks because it's just like social media has really messed up perspectives on relationships and it's messed up some relationships i'm not gonna lie like it's bad like be like oh we have to do this because i see other people doing it or oh if your man will give you flowers he's not the one for you da -da -da -da. do y'all not realize that some relationships you have to start at the bottom to be at the top like let's let's say you and your man are broke like you, but y'all know y'all have a dream not a dream y'all have a passion to building and making it to the top like not every relationship is going to start at the top like you have to start out somewhere you have to start out you have to start out somewhere like broke or whatever like do y'all not see most of these celebrity relationships talking about we started from the ground up like homeless da -da -da -da, and now they got a bank like that like y'all have to start y'all have to have patience with these relationships like y'all always broke this broke niggas, broke niggas bad like oh he's broke i don't want a broke nigga and i understand that i totally get that but i'm not saying date a bum you feel me y'all shame the down low relationship so bad like y'all make it seem like no relationship can start at the bottom and then y'all make one thing i hate about y'all on social media like y'all make it seem like cheating and toxic mess is cute like who told y'all that who told y'all that was cute like then we talk about like cheating TikTok. Like it's a TikTok going around talking about she told me I cheated on her. She accused me of cheating on her, so I did. I don't like false accusations. Are you kidding me right now? Like y'all think that is cute to cheat. Where do we do that at? Like to lie to your partner, you think it's cute to do breakup pranks on your partner, like where do we do that at like what are we doing i can really give my perspective now because as a creator i have seen the most outlandish mess all i can say is really is last thing is just keep it god centered heavy on the god center because god definitely told me he he definitely gives signs y'all i'll tell y'all that he definitely gives signs oh uh, well, i thought somebody tried to in my room god definitely gives signs let me tell you okay like four like four years dog we into lulu and god was giving me every hint in the world and i kind of was just like 
Okay. And it went on to do what I do, and he kept like God was on it. And then I think he just got fed up because <laughs> I think I think God just got fed up, and he was just like, okay, she's gonna learn. Like I'm I'm tired of it at this point. Like, alright, y'all. So I got on the fit. Here is my outfit. I'll show y'all better. Probably I might do the stairwell so I can show y'all. I'm really iffy about this nose thing because. It can easily come out. So I don't think I'm gonna wear it. I'm just very cautious. Glasses, Lore Bay. If you're not a Lore Bay, what are you doing? Get some Lore Bay. Right, on these. Um, what else? Glasses, Lore Bay. Shirt, pretty little thing. And I was about to give away this shirt too. And then last night I looked over and I was like, maybe I do something with this shirt. And that's why I don't get clothes away. <laughs> but shirt, pretty little thing. Bag. Target and I'm kind of upset I don't have an orange bag but if my friend gets back to me in time I might switch but pants pretty little thing also shoes Timo because I know the real ones was like abandoned some more that nose thing got my nose itching but anyway so I'm about to head out y'all and I'm about to go see my man but yeah he just texted me too so yeah I'm about to be on the way y'all I'm okay I'm gonna come back to y'all anyways yeah 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 i finally got him in some jorts y'all let's clap it up like us not even him us combined and individually your outfit hard I, you said blue and orange i'm like blue yeah and, and i don't have an orange purse so we're gonna make do are you recording? huh are you recording? yes, yes ma'am <laughs> i want him to come open the door oh, oh. don't worry about it he can go over the door i thought she wanted to be in it hold on talk to the people you back. Person, oh, I look good in this green. Hold on, a little fit on. You said what? I don't think I want to go back. Y'all want to stay with me? Then they said they want to stay with me. All right, guys. They just took my pics. Now it's his turn. I don't know where you want them at. I don't know why I thought the black top was like green in this, like brighter than this. Yeah. Fashion girl, fashion girlfriend, fashion boyfriend, especially with a girlfriend in a fashion major. What? What's tea? I want to take some. All right, y'all. So it's some time later. Took pics, posted. Her. I'm a little iffy about my pics, but I feel like I'm gonna end up liking them later on. I don't know. And I still got this week, this week worth of outfits. But right now, I'm about to pick up my crew neck. Am getting more involved this year. And I am in a organization called Pre Alumni Council, PAC. And I ordered a crew neck for like when it gets cold and stuff. And I'm on my way to pick it up now. But I'm gonna do that to get back to my room. I'm thinking about changing second fit. <laughs> but something slight though, not nothing too much. All right, y'all, so I'm back. Y'all was overstimulated. I don't know why I just get overstimulated so easily. Anywho, I am back now. I'm just going to uh, upload these videos right quick of what I have so far so that I have space for tonight's event in my phone. I'm pretty sure I will have space either way, but just to be safe, I got like 5, 12 gigabytes, but I'm just going to upload right quick what I got and charge my phone in the meantime and possibly change the outfit because those shoes, like, love them to death, but Lord, I can't act, Lord. I love them, babe. All right, y'all. So I put on a different fit. Y'all should know that though. This actually was not planned. Like I actually was gonna keep on what I had on, but since it's a basketball game, I low key had to put it on for real. So yes, I'm an alpha repeater. And if you're an alpha rememberer, hush. Sweater, Target shirt, AliExpress pants, pretty little thing, boots, Amazon. Uh, purse, TJ Maxx. And it has a little pen stain on it, but okay. And then I have shades. These are shades. So, I am about to go back to Starbucks. I'm probably gonna go to Pizza Hut, get like something small. I have 30 something DB left, but we're not gonna talk about that. I feel like I really put it on for real. But when do I not? Hey guys, 
it's time later. Booski off work. Check the fit. Her honest. Uh, old school 90s fit. Style of the crew neck by me. The rest is him. Hey guys, we are on the way. I took my pictures. <laughs> is it giving two time post tonight? Find out. Tonight. Find out on Olivia Lorraine's YouTube channel. I'm sorry. I gotta see if I wanna poke. I don't care if I'm posting. I'm posting on my pics sitting down. Yeah, here's some of my pics. You know, Bay gonna eat every time. Quick little 90s fit. I'm messing with it though. I feel like I look good. This does give 90s, not like it. Okay, so I'm like, mm, honest. I still got your glasses on. Honest. Oh, well, you do got my glasses. <laughs> We left the basketball game. Uh, it was getting near its end anyway. And it's at eight. It was good though. I mean, it was fun. And then you know how it gets like to a boring part. We hit a boring part. And we need to charge our phone. So In fact, my phone on six. We look, he had no choice but to come back. And we might go out to like cook out our Waffle House. So it's another reason why we came back. We don't want our phones dying. Fact, while we out. Especially since I'm vlogging for you. Ah. We went on a cookout run because we didn't want to go to Waffle House. We the only reason why I didn't want to go to Waffle House is because we're not able to sit down in there because Waffle House is in Nashville after a certain amount of time, like what is like 7 p.m. After 7 or 8 p.m. you can't sit inside. So, and we going to cook out because I don't want to sit inside. I don't, okay. I don't want to like get my food and go and leave. I'm hungry too, so. But yeah, the average, homecoming cookout run is a definite must you agree a cookout cookout run on homecoming week is a definite must for sure it's either that or what else but yeah we're gonna go we made it i don't know if y'all can read it i got a double big double shape Oh my, oh my. You can't even see it, it's upside down. Oh no, right. Just read off to them what you got. A big double tray, oh, oh. cheese and bacon, cajun fries, a ranch wrap, and a huge stick. You got the same thing? I got a double cheeseburger too, with cheese bacon. I said that's a mayo too. Mayo and lettuce. And then I got onion rings and cheese bites. And an Oreo shake. And I'm gonna get nothing in cheese bites before we leave because we're all shit. We're leaving now. The Uber gonna be here in like, a few minutes. A few minutes. All right, all right. <laughs> Done crushed that food right. We ate, now we got energy. I rate this day, 10 out of 10. Angie, Angie, you can get it to what you're trying to do. Please see how Yeah, I gotta go to class before I can get geeked. But tomorrow is like a plain day because I'm not going to the comedy show, so I'm really just gonna be chilling. Oh, where this young fellow at? Day of homecoming. If I want to put it, you know, I did Wednesday, Friday when I thought I was getting my hair done. Was it Saturday? Wednesday when I got my hair done. That was like at night. Saturday when we went shopping. 
I don't even know. I just know that it lasted since last week. And I'm going to upload the footage when I'm not busy and see if I have enough for like, okay, hunk me part one. If not, then I'm going to put this. I'm going to put Wednesday in part one and then Thursday, Friday, Saturday in part two. Yeah. And now I need to get ready. Um, I already got the fit, but it's just a matter of it's a matter of um on a TikTok, two TikToks, doing two TikToks, and am I doing two TikToks? Yeah, to get ready with me and piece of week. With that being said, I already got the fit out. I really just need to get dressed in order to get dressed. I have to do the get ready with me. So first thing I'm gonna do, brush my teeth, wash my face, and then I'm really not in a makeup mood today. Like I'm really just gonna concealer lashes keep it pushing because that's really my go-to when i don't on a on an everyday or not even lashes just concealer and mascara on an everyday when i don't feel like doing nothing else so i feel like that's what i'm gonna do today but yeah i'm gonna hit y'all i uploaded my tiktok on my hard body page like the get ready with me day one i uploaded that on my hard body page and my tiktok now, i don't have i don't have the hard body tiktok anymore keep that in mind yeah, I'm gonna show you how to fit after because I do gotta go to class today. Yeah, I have three classes. I have environmental design this morning. My philosophy class is on Zoom, so I'll be back in here. And then I got a pre -cow. And after that, I'm free for the day. All right, y'all, so I am now dressed. Do y'all see this sweater? <laughs> not a part of the plan. Like, this was not one of the outfits, but hey. But here's the fit. Oh, y'all can't even see it for real. Skirt, little loafers, y'all see, y'all see, y'all see, yeah. So I am back from class. I did not end up like coming back to my room after my 9 a.m. I just went like hung out. Well, y'all y'all heard me. My shirt came in. <laughs> Who bought it for me? My man. <laughs> Anyways, so now I'm changing my outfit once again. Changing my homecoming week outfit once again because this outfit was not even planned. My girl Taiki, I'm pretty sure y'all know who I'm talking about. Cause what? Go ahead and get y'all a shirt, you feel me? Rich off content. Cause what? Over here doing my big one. I'm not called hard body for a re for no reason, Buki. Like what are we talking about? What are we talking about? This shirt is so freaking cute and I was literally excited. And like, okay, so when you go to the post office, you uh unlock your little locker thing and if you got a slip it in that means you got something so i seen i had a slip so i thought it was a package that my parents are sending me i'm like okay like i came on time i seen pink bag like small pink bag and i remember from taiki's story her uh like when she posted her like doing her orders the bags were pink so i was like this is the shirt so i was like really excited so yeah <laughs> yeah and i gotta reconsider my outfit not really reconsider but like a little minor change to it Right now, I'm hungry. I have not had a lick of a drink. I haven't had a lick of food. No, nothing, y'all. Like, nothing. 
So I'm right now I'm gonna change because when I tell you all these loafers are so I love them. I love them, don't get me wrong. But they're just low-key irritating to walk in because they're like a little my heel slips off the back basically. I'm not complaining because I still ate the girls down. While I'm doing that, or not while I'm doing that. Uh, what else I have to tell y'all? Oh, the reason why my man came to come get me, like, from class, from my 9 a.m. I was walking to class, right? And, um, if y'all can't tell, I'm looking for, like, a good lighting. Let me, maybe I should turn this light off. Um, so I'm walking to my 9 a.m., right? And if you go to TSU, you know the egg complex, like, the egg, the egg hills, what we call it. Cool. So I'm walking to class. And I'm halfway up the hill. And all of a sudden, I look in the corner of my eye and I see this man following me. Like this old, he was like, oh, I remember the description very well. Tan tan hat, gray beard, like gray beard, dark skin, kind of skinny, brown jacket, blue jeans, tan or black shoes, I don't remember. Tan in his pockets, he was just looking down. And he was like, following me up like slowly creeping up the hill and I kind of was like I don't know if he because at first when I first seen him when I was going up the hill he was just sitting on a bench next to the air complex like when you first get into the air complex so I'm like okay he just chilling then as soon as I crossed the street and started walking up the hill to my building that's when he got up and he started following me so I'm like oh heck no right but when I turned around I was going up step to get into the building I turned around and one of my classmates was right there and once he passed, once my classmate passed him on the sidewalk, like he passed him to go into the building as well, he just stopped. So I was like, yeah, no, just in case. So I texted my man. I was like, why is this guy following me? And with no hesitation, he was like, what time your class and where is it at? I'm going to come get you. And that's why I love my man. Like, what are we talking about? But yeah, I was like, oh, no, ma'am. And the one time I don't use my nightstick tripod because the way I would have hold on where is it the way i would have had him the way i would have had him all i gotta do is part and you i don't think y'all understand how this hurts my hand right now as we speak oh, we're going. you gotta put your shoulder in it's where you at it's where you at your shoulder in you gotta okay well, put your shoulder in because we're doing work we're being scholars for once anyway oh, i'm just playing <laughs> Kabuki after the midterm, right? <laughs> my parents would be very disappointed. That's what I'm saying. Very disappointed. <laughs> hey, y'all. Y'all hear that crack in my voice? It is 11.57. I went to go chill with friends for like hours. And I about so sleep. Back in the room now. Like, I just got back like 10 minutes ago. I'm sad. I got charge on my devices. Uh, check over this one assignment for class tomorrow. Only got one class, and I'm good for the day. Sad to say. Well, not really sad to say, because there's a part two. But I am closing out part one. Let me get a little sneak peek at the thumbnail. Because it's fat. I mean, not, it's just really a sneak peek, because y'all finna click this video anyway. Seeing the thumbnail, you feel me? But this is what i got so far like hold on i'm just gonna flip my screen i'm gonna flip my screen okay so this is what i got so far right and i'm gonna put wording like other wording of like what each thing is but i just think this right here is so fat like i find out i found out how to like outline myself and i'm still thinking about the uh out like the font of this but i think i might keep it to this or i might change it to this font right here but i just think it's so far and i'm gonna put words around this right here but um, I just think it's so freaking fire, like, like, ah, I did my big one, but I'm not done yet. So yeah, I'm not done yet, but um, I'm gonna watch my, my girl vlog, the night she knew, why? I need to watch my other friends vlog, I need to watch my mutual vlogs. I normally just go to my subscriptions and just press like anything. Like I just let it like run. It's between my girl Rain, Destiny, uh, my girl, I hope I say her name right, Alicia Monet. I hope I said her name right. Maya. How do you say her name? Maya Beach Beatrice. That's my girl right there. I love Maya videos. Like, she's inspired me to become like a soft girl, like soft girl vibe. 
my girl Taylor Simone. I'm gonna put everybody name and stuff. My girl uh, Nicole Leno. This Ty Keith, uh, Ty Thornton. I just need a few people. If I name you, I'm so sorry. Andrea and Melissa. That's my girl right there. That's Buki. But um, cause we were just talking about Ty Keith shirts and what outfits we gonna wear. And I'm wearing my outfits tomorrow because there's the shirt. Anyway, there's the shirt wrap. But I'm going to shower, eat a little something, and go to bed. But uh, I hope you all enjoyed part one. It just happens like, this is the second year this happened. Like, everything else happens in part two. But see, people still watch part one. But, like, everything else happens in part two. Like, the real, the real, the real, the real, you feel me? But, yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this vlog. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. But I'm back on my consistent stuff. I promise this time, I promise. Please, like, I pinky promise. Like, y'all see my pinky? Pinky promise me. Pinky promise me. Like, I, I swear. I promise y'all. It's just like school. I just make sense with school and stuff, and I'm still working hard. You feel me? If you like, come subscribe. Hit that bell for more from me. I hope you have a blessed day, night, evening, life, whatever. I love y'all. Bye.